Hello and welcome. Today we're at Elmo Springtacular at Sesame Place in Langhorne, Pennsylvania. And I'm also, as part of like the Photo Ambassador program, picking up this little guy. I think they've been winter themed for the last couple of years, but I do get a platinum pass for participating in the program. Did you get a summer one, Jason? Yeah, I did. This is Jason, New Jersey Coasters. Uh, so this was last year's. Yeah, I had that one. But also, they're kind of flimsy, like papery. I don't know why they, they do that. Do you ever laminate it or you put it in a pouch? To, uh, okay. Well, we're going to head in. This carousel has just opened up, the Sunny Day Carousel. So let's get to it. Got some photos to take. So here we are at the Sunny Day Carousel. There he goes with his little Fuji. But they gave it a repaint and it looks really good. It looks really nice. You can tell how fresh it looks, fresh to death even. I'm just kind of looking around right now, taking a moment to kind of see what else we can put in the foreground. Are there flowers? The flower beds are still still pretty fresh, so that's a no help if we wanted to go low. Plus, we have this in the way. What kind of angles can we get, Jason? I don't know. Let's take out my other camera. What's the matter? Let's take out my other camera because this one's small. You got something with better reach? I feel like we could probably find somewhere to use a zoom. Pretty good telephoto lens. Are we going to ride it? We should ride it. <laughs> we have the ERT till 10.30. Oh, for real? Is that a thing? I think yes, I saw a sign for that. So Jason was right. Early ride time, April 28th, 9.30 to 10.30 for, uh, for all past members. Well, you want to do that first? Maybe that'll bring some inspiration out of us or something? I don't know. He's already switched to the other camera. And, I'll switch back and forth all day. Oh wow, Vapor Trail's already going. They have roller coaster. Is this roller coaster usually open this early? Yeah, it's black. Cannot open Is it Oscars? That's usually not. But we already saw that test, so that's a good sign. So here we are. I'm trying to figure out if there's any like. I think all the horses are unique in terms of their patterns. That's pretty great. And let's see what else. I mean, you might know if you've been here. This is where the big topiary normally was previously. And this opened up a whole big space for a playground down at the bottom of the hill. You switch to your back to the Fuji? Yeah, I'm going back and forth. That's what I want to do all Yeah, do you want like an 18 mil shot? I'll give you a nice shot, new profile photo for Instagram. You on a horse. As we're in the queue, which is pretty big, um, there's like, is this meant to be covered at some point? Completed, perhaps? Or is this just the look? I don't know. I think during the summer we would welcome the shade. All right, I really like the ABC horse. This guy definitely, or girl, is going to be in some of my photos. Get up there, Jason. You got this. Yeah. Make sure to put on your seatbelt, sir. How we doing? We'll find out. We'll see if we go up and down <laughs> yeah. or we break. Or we break, yeah. But yeah, so just kind of taking this in, doing the one and done type of ride. Say we've done it. Pick a favorite horse, take some photos, and then we'll be moving on. Even the local birds are super curious about what's going on here with this new carousel. Oh, there he goes. So just some quick observations here. So you, adults, if they want to sit on the horses, do have to put on a seatbelt. There's no video or photo while the cycle is actually happening. So while the carousel is going, none of that. They were talking on the speakers about that and yelling at even parents that were trying to take photos of their kids. So just FYI. Also, the cycle time is kind of short. I think, how long do you think that cycle was? Like a minute, maybe? That's, 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 that's being generous, honestly. A, a minute's being generous? It. He stopped it. Oh, you think he manually stopped oh, yeah, he it? Did. I watched him. All right, well, now that that's over with, let's take some photos. So we've waited around for like four cycles, I think. That was four, right, Jason? It was like 30, 40 minutes. Yeah, it took, it took about 10 minutes per cycle, so the line is a little backed up, and the actual cycle time was only like a minute at most, which is rough. 
But anyway, where are we headed next? I think it's time for a strategic pretzel break. Looks like they have this new overhang here for the characters to meet and greet in the shade. And I guess in the rain as well, it's safe for them. That's pretty sweet. They didn't have any pretzels at the front of the park, so we're heading on to the back. Well, here's the 123 playground. This is where the carousel used to be. I don't know when this is expected to be opening, but everything else behind it is open. They do have signage indicating as much, like the gift shop, Mr. Hooper's Food Market, and Elmo's World. And yeah, I, I'm not sure what else is going on down this way, because the characters were meeting and greeting over on this end. I feel like slowly they're just kind of revamping all of this area starting with the front. Here's a quick little look over the fence of what's going on with the 123 Playground. So Jason, what happened? We couldn't find any pretzels. There's only one place open that sells them and there's none in the warmer. All right, I guess uh, that was... Go beg for it. <laughs> Go beg for it. Um, and also, they're doing like a Passover thing the day that we're here at the Sesame Street Theater. And I believe there's also a PJ Masks thing, but they have rotating special visitors coming. Uh, from now until June. Those usually require a reservation, however, so you have to make that online or on the app. Uh, I think on the website is probably your best bet, though. I've never seen a man more determined to get a pretzel. He's asking when will the pretzels be out. So there is a Furry Friends dance party about to go down here. I don't know if we can find a place to take photos from. However, also, Oscar's Wacky Taxi is open. Normally, I, I don't think I see it open before noon very often. We actually opted to head over to Oscar's Wacky Taxi while we wait for these pretzels. But I think also we're going to just grab some photos and videos real quick of the ride, too. So I think we're all set here with Oscar's Wacky Taxi. Took a few vertical video clips, a couple of photos, and that'll do it for now. There is a nice little angle here that I'm probably going to try to get, but I don't know if we want to wait it, wait for it. There it goes. We're now coming full circle. Jason is getting a pretzel. However, sadly, these are not Elmo shaped. So are you, uh, you all set there now? You got a giant water cup, a pretzel. Yep, you're having a Sesame Place day. It's actually not bad. The pretzel's not bad? <laughs> that's, that's good to hear. Yeah, I'll try a bit in a minute. <laughs> so the pretzel was actually pretty decent. And I think that's it. Mission accomplished for today. We were only asked to take photos of the carousel. Wacky Taxi was kind of a bonus just because it opened pretty early. I'll be back for sure when the playground opens and to get some photos for the springtacular version of the parade. Uh, any thoughts about this new carousel? Same carousel repainted. I mean, it, it, but it looks nice. It looks nice. <laughs> I do also like the new location. I don't know if you've been here on a busy day, but it can. It gets real nuts in here, and it's tough to actually navigate. I can't imagine how families and larger groups with strollers and mobility, via, like, how they do any of that. So anyway, uh, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time, and I hope you go make your own adventure. Bye. Bye. Whoa, look, you're riding the horses. Are you ready to ride the horse?